In this video, I'm gonna compare Software versus Flutterflow and tell you which one is the best. So if you guys wanna start with one of them, watch this video till the end to don't miss any important information. Software and Flutterflow are both no-code platforms that help you build apps without coding, but they focus on different things. Let's compare them. First, let's talk about Software. What is Software for? Software is great for building websites, web apps, and tools like client portals or internal dashboards. It's designed to work with data from Airtable or Google Sheets. Ease of use, super easy even for beginners. Its drag and drop interface is simple, and you can create a basic app or website quickly without any tech skills. Now, let's talk about the features. Connects easily with Airtable, Zapier, Stripe, and Google Analytics for data and payments. Great for simple projects like directions, portals, or small businesses' websites. Lets you customize design, colors, fonts, layouts without coding. Fast to set up and publish apps independently. The pricing start at $49 a month with a free tier for basic use. Good for small projects or startups. The app is best for non-technical users, small businesses, or anyone who wants to build simple web apps or websites fast. Now, let's talk about Flutterflow. Flutterflow is focused on building mobile apps for iOS and Android. With a visual editor, it's built on Flutter, so it's good for creating more complex, high-performance apps. The ease of use, a bit more technical than software, with a steeper learning curve. It's still no code, but you might need to learn some concept like widget trees for advanced apps. Now, let's talk about features. A strong API integration, for example, Firebase Algolia, for dynamic apps with real-time data or advanced search. Offers lots of pre-built widgets and templates for faster app creation. Supports complex apps with custom features and can export code if you need a developer to tweak it. Good for scaling if your app gets popular. The pricing starts at $25 a month, but costs can raise for advanced features worth it for complex mobile app. And that is best for developers or startup building mobile app that need advanced features or plan to grow big. So what are the key differences between Flutterflow and Software? The app type. Software is better for web apps and websites. Flutterflow is better for mobile apps. Ease. Software is simpler and faster for beginners. Flutterflow takes more time to learn but offers more power. Customization. Flutterflow allows more complex customization while software focuses on simplicity. Integrations. Software works well with general tools like Zapier. Flutterflow connects to technical services like Firebase or advanced functionality. Scalability. Flutterflow is better for apps that need to handle lots of users on complex features. So, which is the best? Choose software if you're a beginner, a small business, or non-technical user who wants to quickly build a simple website. Web app or portal without much hassle is perfect for projects like client portal, directories, or internal tools. Choose Flutterflow if you're building a mobile app, need advanced features, or want something that can grow with a larger user base. It's better for startups or developers who are okay with a learning curve. So, this is it. Thanks for watching this video.